Hey everyone, it's Sean here, your guide to Warcraft. And if you're a rogue and you play Legion, you might have come across an ability called Detection, which is completely useless and all it does is does this. Just gives you the graphic effect of a trinket, and I really got fed up and I just wanted to know what it was used for. I had no intention of making a video, I just wanted to find out what this was used for because I had gotten tired of it. And you can buy this glyph from your class order hall vendor here. If you have not seen or heard of this yet, you can buy it there for some gold. And after doing some digging, I found out this actually does have a use somewhere in the world. So I decided to go and check it out. You also will need to buy a Glyph of Disguise. This is a pickpocketing glyph which disguises you as the target you pickpocket. So be sure to grab that before you actually follow any of the steps in the video. Now you want to head to Ravenhold Manor. And if you're not familiar with Ravenhold Manor, this is sort of the old hidden hub of some of the rogues. There's a faction here for Ravenhold. And, well, it's just sort of like the coolest place that I imagined a rogue class order hall would have been before they announced it to be in the Underbelly and Dalaran. But hey, anyway, so... You want to get here in Hillsbred Foothills, you want to get to Ravenhold Manor, and we're not going inside the manor just yet, you want to follow where I go in the video, you want to head up here on top of some of these sort of mountains, and you'll see a level 85 ghost overlooking Durnhold Keep. Now, he is neutral and he is attackable, but you do not want to kill this ghost, you want to instead go in stealth, you want to pickpocket this ghost, steal his one silver, and then you will get your 5 minute buff which will disguise you as the target you've pickpocketed, so you will be disguised as this NPC here. This buff does last for 5 minutes, like I said, so, you know, there's not really a time constraint, you know, you're going to be able to do this in 5 minutes, you're going to be able to do this in 1 minute. So you want to mount up, you want to head back to Ravenhold Manor, and we're going to be using our detection ability. You want to head into the manor through the front door, you want to go left, you want to go down these stairs, and you want to head into the basement. I believe there was something to do with Raffi in here, there's like a black drake egg, I think that's where Raffi hatched. I'm not too familiar with it, but... On the right hand side, if you use your detection ability, a ghost will appear. And then once you click on this ghost, he will offer a dialogue option. And then you will tell it that you're its master. And it's just like, uh, close enough. Best I'm going to get. And then it will give you an item. And this is called the Survivor's Bag of Coins. Weirdly, this item isn't a toy. It is just a usable item. Although I can see it probably becoming a toy in the future. I guess they just didn't make it a toy to hide it, but there are already hidden toys in the toy box that you can't always see until you obtain them, so I'm not quite sure on that. But before we can use it, we need to go actually get some coins for the bag of coins. And I'm not talking about copper, silver, or gold. I'm talking about coins that you can only pickpocket off of humanoids. So I just flew over to Alterac, decided to go pickpocket some ogres, and as you can see, I'm getting a buff on the top right hand side of my screen and this is stackable I see I've got like 17 which means I have 17 coins in this bag of coins and then each time you use it you lose a coin so I have 17 charges of this and what it does is it seems to just slingshot you in whatever direction so as you can see you can use it from quite far away as well and it just bounces you up and down so this could actually be quite useful for getting places i imagine it might be useful for situations where there's no flying especially maybe in bfa if this is still usable if you main a rogue and there's something quite high up maybe this would actually be of some use so this isn't just some pointless item this actually might be quite useful for people you know especially in world pvp i mean you're just flinging around the map so i'm very happy to actually finally learn that there is a use for detection i did read some other comments online that there are other uses i heard people use it in the cordana fight in vault of the wardens i heard people use it for to detect invisibility so you can't detect stealth but like mages invisibility and yeah i ran out of coins and i died but yeah, that's all for this video. Thank you very much for watching. Be sure to subscribe for some more Warcraft guides and videos. Leave a comment if there are any more uses. I am very curious about this. So thanks again, and I'll see you next time.